to you and welcome to the Fan Channel Forever. I have been waiting quite some time for this psycho to lose their mind once again. I just finished watching Jenny's latest January 30th, 2023 video, and I am shocked at some of the things she said. The video begins, Jenny explaining that she's going to have breakfast with her husband. What she really meant was, she is going to eat food at around the same time, in the same home, as her husband. They are not eating breakfast together. It's even more obvious when she explains that her husband tells her, no, he's not having eggs. He's having chili the same as her. Except, she isn't only having chili. She's also having a healthy choice meal on the side. And it's breakfast. Sidetracked from the drama, Jenny decides not to eat and go on to talk about Mark. She attempts to cover up the fact that she had very overly friendly private conversations with him. Things like, my husband and I aren't really together and he has a girlfriend named Valerie. I'm sorry, but that is not a joke you're playing on someone else. It's a joke that you're playing on yourself. People that propagate lies in order to make themselves appear better than they are do not say things like, my husband has a girlfriend named Valerie that he's banging on the side. That would just make someone look like a complete idiot. It is, however, much better than trying to claim that your ex-boyfriend, who was a heroin and cocaine addict, used to rape you by gunpoint. But we can leave that tale for another time that is more appropriate. Then she tries to explain that she's orchestrated all of this to have a laugh and have some fun. What makes this so funny to me is one or two videos ago, she is talking about Mark throughout the entire video, claiming she crushed his heart and how he cannot abuse her anymore. It sounds to me like they just had a breakup is really what happened. Jenny then says that Annie told her that she's been doing these things in order to gain Melody's attention. That is actually the trigger in this video, and from this point on, it's nothing but nefarious lies. She tries to defend against Annie's statement and basically says no, that she is not doing anything to cause Melody's attention. Then immediately the next thing out of her mouth is that Melody's boyfriend is a pervert. It's a perfect example of someone's uncalculated train of thought. Jenny had no good reason to come up with why she was bashing these people, so she just made up one. And from what she says further, it seems as though if a man watches Jenny's videos, then he is deemed a pervert. Am I getting this right, Jenny? I knew that if I waited patiently, Jenny would just go right back to exactly what she was doing. I'm counting on it, and I'm banking on it. She has the same type of syndrome that Gorilla Bear Tech had, where so much time can pass, and they must aggravate a situation in order to make something happen. This, this is what's going to happen. I'm going to analyze and review and react to what you say on camera. Because eventually, as the years pass by, you may begin to learn that what I am doing is very similar to what you are doing. Except, people will come to my channel for the factual truth. And they will come to your channel for the exaggerated lies. People think that Jenny is obsessed with Boogie and possibly in love with him. Remember that she regularly states that she is not obsessed with Boogie. Just to make it extra clear for everyone out there that is constantly wondering about it. Saying things like, he doesn't show me love and he doesn't show me kindness. 
really shows that there's something extremely fucked up going on in that head. Lady, this man wants you to stop talking about his girlfriend and him. There is not even a chance that these people are going to be your friends. Move on with your life. Just before the 10 minute mark of this video, Jenny turns and goes on to a complete bashing session over Melody. From that point, for the next 5 minutes, is a serious, sinister, narcissistic style, bipolar mood swing that cannot be controlled. This woman is not in control of herself, cannot help, but spewing the things that are coming out of her mouth, all unprovoked at this point. No one has said anything about her, because nobody really cares. And here she is, going off on a tangent, like it's 2020. I suppose when someone believes that video creation is filming a washing machine washing laundry, or having a hairdryer glow in the background while filming the ceiling is actual content, it can cause them to become a little angry in some videos and reflect on some of the things that happened in the past. Things they cannot let go of, like someone else's boyfriend not falling in love with them. There was just a countless number of lies in this video. They just kept on coming. One might to wonder if Jenny is a pathological liar, but she is not. This is completely built on impulse alone. It is the narrative of her conversation that causes her to impulsively lie about herself and others. She is so fucking unaware and out of control of herself that she doesn't even realize while she begins to bash AGB that the video cuts her off. Even the tablet got tired of her bullshit. Please stand by.